Hi guys, welcome back to my blog on webmastervideoschool.com. In this lesson, or in this post, I will teach you how to create this very simple but nice CSS uh, frame or uh, border effect. So basically, let's go to our editor and I will explain you how this result is, uh, is achieved. Okay, here is my page2.html uh, web page. It is including just border1, border2, and main styles. Let's take a look at our uh, CSS file which is attached to my page2.html. Okay, here we have the border style, the border2 style, and the main style which is actually our picture. Okay, let's start with our border style. The background color is set to gray, the float is set to left, and of course if I'm using the float I must use also the size parameters for this style. Okay, so let's remove all the other styles for now and let's take a look at our border style by itself. Let's save by clicking Ctrl S and refresh our web page by clicking F5. Okay, here is our square. The color as you see is gray. And now let's add our second style here which is border 2. Let's delete for now the main style. Let's save and refresh. Okay, now we have two styles. Uh, we have this gray style, this gray square, and up uh, or on the square we have uh, some other square which is filled with lighter gray color. Let's talk about this style. The background is set to be lighter gray. The float is still left. Then we have the size. Pay attention that the size is 10 pixels uh, less and that is why uh, that is because we have the margin here so basically this is one square okay and then we have the smaller square inside okay this size is 10 pix pixels smaller because we have 5 pixels here and another 5 pixels here and same for the left and right uh, margins. Okay, so let's go back and also add our image. This is the main style which is including our image. Okay, here is the background image attribute. And then we have the size again. And again, this is 10 pixels less than in the border 2 style. Okay, we are decreasing 10 pixels here and 10 pixels here and same for the height. 10 pixels here and 10 pixels here because we have a margin from each directions from each direction of 5 pixels. Okay, let's save those pages now by clicking Ctrl S and let's refresh our page and here you can see the picture which is here we, ha we have actually 10 pixels and here 10 pixels and for each frame we have 5 pixels width. Okay, that's all. Very simple but a nice effect. I hope you will be able to use it on your websites and of course you are always welcome to come back to my blog, my video blog on webmastervideoschool.com. Bye bye.